Yo, what is up everybody and welcome to another Madden 13 online game. Today we have a rival game, Eagles and Giants. And, you know, anytime in real life the Eagles and Giants match up, you know it's going to be a crazy game. Because that's just the way it is. Any NFC East game, I think, like, out of all the conferences, that's the conference that has, like, the most pride. No matter what the records are, teams have the most pride in them. You got the Eagles, the Cowboys, America's team, the Giants, the G-Men, the um, New York City market, the Redskins, and the DC market, so... Four big markets, four fra um, storied franchises and all that. So, um, yeah, let's see what happens here, though. Um, There's not going to be a halftime show. There will be a post-game show. And um, if you already see the title and all that, you probably know what I'm talking about if you play this game enough or even watching the videos, what's going to happen at the end here. But um, let's just get into this game here. I got a nice touchdown early. He punted the ball since I made a stop, and I got a touchdown. All good, using my Giants tier since um, they're my favorite team. Though he's moving in with the Eagles. He's got another first down. This um, curl route to Jeremy Macklin. Next play, he tries to hit a slant. But instead, Justin Tryon makes the pick. I think that's his name. And he doesn't just make the pick. He takes it back, and that's a touchdown. And we all go up 14 nothing right before the first quarter ends. So um, we're feeling good, you know. I think we might have a win in hand, so I'm not going to like get cocky or anything because he has been moving the ball okay. He just got a huge play to Jeremy, Johnny Jason Avant beating the um, zones there and all that. Here, just barely gets that one in there to Matt, oh, Matt McCoy. LaShawn McCoy and gets a lot of extra yards there since McCoy is fast. Next play, once again, perfect pass into the zone to Avant. And um, now he's at the goal line. Now he's inching up for a touchdown. Second down and six, throwing it out the backfield to McCoy. And he's able to run down to the touchdown before um, Chase Blackburn can get there. He's supposed to be manning him. And here I have um, Jarrell Jernigan returning kicks. I didn't fix the depth chart for this game, though um, I eventually do. But here I hit the um, outslant to Martellus Bennett. And here I kept them coming out in five wide for whatever reason. I probably should have not done that. Here I get Fly for throwing it out. I thought I thought it was a roughing the passer when it first happened, but instead I get penalized here, and I think they penalize him like an extra five yards. I'm not too sure. Though um, I get a nice ten yard completion to Hakeem Nix, brings up a more manageable third down and ten, and let's see what happens here. I'm going deep for Hakeem. I tried to lob it, but didn't really get to, and I guess that's more just like a punt of anything because he ends up getting at his own like 35 here. So you know it's not too bad. And um, a Togway makes the pick. A Togway got um cut by the Eagles. So I mean. Hopefully he's not overrated, because <laughs> he's already, he's been overrated for a while now. After he sucked last year in the skins. There he um he gets a big third down conversion to Jason Avant. Don't know how the hell he gets that one, but he was throwing that a few times to Avant, where the coverage was tight, but he would somehow get the throw in. I guess he was pass leading. There he gets a nice um curl route. He's running quite a few curl routes there. He got one. Next play, you know, nothing's open, trying to keep everything blocked up. Though he runs out the pocket with Vic. I didn't have a quarterback spy set up on that one. Brings up third down and one, and he ends up running it and getting the first down to McCoy. Two-minute warning is hit. Now, here he's running it out the pocket with Vic. Brings up second down and three. Now, a minute left. We dropped the pick on third down, though. I think that's um, Kiwanuka dropped it. But it's okay. We forced him to um, get a field goal. We still have the lead. We're good. Though here we're trying to run the screen, Eli throws a pass to um someone's helmet, so that sucked. And here on third down, the safety plays the out route perfect on Bennett, ends up picking it and ends up taking it for a touchdown. And that's exactly what I didn't want to happen. So I get ball back at half, you know what I mean? I did not want to lose my lead here. I just wanted to do whatever I could to preserve instead I throw a pick six. And then um, here I put um, Darrell Scott. He's got 96 speed. I put him in to return kicks. He ended up getting an all right one. There, I tried to hit up A. But I couldn't even do it before anything happened. And then um, right before the half ends, I just throw one deep for Hakeem. He ends up picking it off, but it doesn't really matter because the half's about to end. And here I go use the bathroom before the half ends. So this play was going. I wasn't even here. I was in the bathroom when this play was happening. And he ends up running out the pocket with Mike Vick for a few yards. So that's all good. Though um, we're down. We had a 14 nothing lead, and we pretty much blew it. Out of halftime. So here we go. Return to kick with Darrell Scott. And we got clear field. And Darrell Scott is going to the house. And I get yet another return for a touchdown this game. My special teams have been deadly this year. And we take the lead on that. Didn't have to waste any time on offense. So that feels good. That feels great. And um, he can't do the same on his um kick return. So that's good. And here he gets that same completion to Macklin. I'm not sure how. Oh, not back in Vaughn. I'm not sure how he's getting that. But, I mean, he was getting that quite a few times. Here he tries to hit the out route, or um, out slant. I'm not really sure. But um, I almost picked it off, so that's the end result there. Here, um, 
Deshaun Jackson gets wide open. I don't even know what the hell Corey Webster is doing, but Deshaun Jackson ends up wide open using his speed and all that. And here he tries to go deep, and I try to pick it off, but my dude doesn't even jump. I'm not really sure. I, I still don't got that ball hawking thing down. Though here, third down nine, we make a nice stop, end up forcing him to check it down, and he gets absolutely nothing, and he settles for the field goal. Tries to play it smart, make it a one-point game instead of going for it. And here we're returning it again, and we got clear field again, except for he purposely sat a guy so I don't get the touchdown. That, that's a new strategy. I've never seen that one before, but um, yeah, he purposely had a guy sitting back there just so I wouldn't get the touchdown. So, And I didn't even see him until the last minute. And oh my god, Ahmad Bradshaw put that dude to sleep on the stiff arm. And then here, third down 11, hitting up a huge curl route here. I want to get a touchdown here so badly, and that was big to help me. Next play, run a pitch to Ahmad Bradshaw, and we got a touchdown as we head into the fourth quarter. And now, um, got to make some stops on defense, but he gets a curl route. Nope. Corey Webster forces the drop. Third down and seven, he tries to, tries to hit up that same fluky play to Avant. Doesn't work. Huge fourth down and seven. He's going for it. He calls the curl route. He gets it, but it's short. It's short. And now, um... Let's see what happens. It looks like he's rage quitting, but um, unfortunately that's not the case because he is going to kick me out the game. He's going to make me lose my connection, pretty much. I think it's IP booting, they call it. Never had it happen to me before until now, and um, yeah, the dude's name is Eagles here, so if you ever run into him, you know, just back out because he's going to, he doesn't play fair, man. Kicks you out, and um, send him a message if you feel like it. Flag is, um... His gamer tag, you want to do whatever you want to do, man, but um, just don't play him because, you know, he's an IP booter, unfortunately. And I let him know about it after the game, and um, I had a 10-game winning streak going on, so I've been beastly, but um, and I had a, my 11th in a row set up here, but um, my dude boots me. And, of course, I don't, I'm not really big on my record. It's, the leaderboard doesn't pay money, so I don't really care about it otherwise, you know what I mean, so... So whatever, man. I'll see you guys next time for more Madden 13 online. Hope you guys liked the game. And we all know who won that game, man. Look at this guy. He's playing stupid. Tell, he's like, I got the loss here. As you're going to see, you know, the dude gave me the loss. And, um, yeah. Just in case you guys think I was doing that lost connection or anything. But, um, yeah, I'll see you guys next time for more Madden 13 online. Peace out, guys.